Hey, I'm sorry this is a shitty webcam video, but this is the best I can do right now. Because I am pretty busy, so I hadn't had time during the day. And now I'm watching Fetal's stuff, which is really, really entertaining. So I have to do this really quick, and I'm sorry for that. Um, so, the first question of the survey is, why are you called like that? I am called Tina Nina. And this is because of my brother, when he was two years old and I was still in my mother's belly, he um, heard a song which was called Tina Nina New by Alex Chilton and it became his favourite song. So he used to say to my mother, we have to call your daughter Tina Nina New. And my mother said, no, we can't. And he said, we have to call her Tina Nina New. My mother said, no, we can't. And he did it that he did it so often that in the end I was called Tina Nina, which is really awesome, and I love my brother for that, and also my parents, because it's the most awesome name I could ever think of. I mean, it's rhyming and it has a height in, and it's awesome as hell. And this TV is confusing. Okay, next question is tell us about your favorite school teacher. So I'm not gonna say his name, because. He is the most awesome teacher in the world, and I think he's stoned pretty much every lesson, which makes him so beautiful. <laughs> no, he's just a wonderful person, and I could tell you so much stories, but I don't want to get anyone in trouble. And, yeah, <laughs> next story. Um, What's the strangest thing you ever eaten? I... I haven't eaten like any crazy meat because I'm vegetarian, but I have mixed a lot of things. When I was younger, I always used to like eat my chips with smoothie, which is actually really good. So let's move on because I think the film is already beginning. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I just love the Beatles. Um, tell us about your first gig. So my parents took me like. To every gig they went to, and the first one I can remember is like a reggae gig thing, and it was really awesome because uh, there was this reggae guy who was playing at stage, I think, before, and he asked me if I would like to drum with him, and I was like, I don't know, seven or younger, I'm, I'm not sure, but he said I'm a really, really good drummer and I should drum with him and I just was so, so amazed by that that he found that I drum cool so I drum with this really awesome guy and then my father started to working started to work at a life club and I heard every band ever in the universe <laughs> which weren't that big bands but really awesome bands and then I went home oh, no, don't talk I, I sorry <laughs> yeah I went to like one big concert which was I don't know anymore I'm sorry I'm confused so the first concert I went on my own was ACDC and I have to go away with this TV so <laughs> the first band I went to on my own without my parents was ACDC and it was on my birthday and my cousin lives in the town where they played and she said she said I should come over to her so we can at least hear it and I turned 13 or 12 I'm not sure so we heard that they began to play and then oh don't call me now um <laughs> see I'm busy uh, they, 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 they started to play, and we said we should totally get there. So we took our bikes and we got out, and like in one second we were wetter than we would have fallen into a lake. Um, we drove down the road, and the water was like as high as our knees, and we were on bikes. So we saw beer cans swimming down the road, and then we got to a massive wave of people coming ahead, uh, coming ahead, I can't even talk today, 
coming to us, going away from the concert, and we were like, they, why are they going away? And then we realized that the wall is so high, they could probably not stand where they were, where they were, where they were, uh, you know what I mean. So we went there, and suddenly we, suddenly we were in the area where the concert was happening, and it was like one of the most awesome births, the most awesome first dates in my life. Sorry, but the Beatles, and oh, I just can't concentrate, but I have to do this because I love to do it. And yes, next thing, tell us about your favorite place in the world, wherever my friends are. Uh, people, just people I think are awesome and. If that's okay, the place doesn't really matter anymore. Um, who do you want to do? Is this that? Yes, it's the last one. I'm sorry, but you know, Beatles. <laughs> who do you want to do the seven eggs? Just the morons and whoever wants to do it as well. I think. I, I don't know. I, <laughs> I'm so confused. I'm sorry. And sorry again. I hope it. I hope. I hope it wasn't too confusing. Oh God. Goodbye, guys, and I'll see you next week when I hopefully be less stressed. Less, less stressed. Oh God. Goodbye.